Hello everyone. Let us solve this sum. Square root of 121 divided by 11 minus square root of 120. We have to find out value of this without using calculator. So, solution. Square root of 121 divided by 11 minus square root of 120. This can be written as square root of 121 into 1 upon 11 minus square root of 120. Since we know square root of a into b is equal to square root of a into square root of b. This is equal to applying this formula here square root of 121 into square root of 1 upon 11 minus square root of 120. Square root of 121 is equal to 11 into. Now here take rationalization of denominator. So 1 upon 11 minus square root of 120 into 11 plus 120 divided by 11 plus 120. This is equal to 11 into square root of numerator 11 plus square root of 120 and denominator 11 minus square root of 120 into 11 plus square root of 120. This is equal to 11 into keeping numerator as it is now denominator is in the form of a minus b into a plus b so applying formula this can be written as 11 square minus square root of 120 its square. Now here square cancel with this square root and we applied this formula a minus b into a plus b is equal to a square minus b square. Hence this is equal to 11 into square root of keeping numerator as it is divided by 11 square is 121 minus 120 that gives 1. So this is equal to 11 into square root of 11 plus square root of 120 divided by 1 which is equal to 11 into square root of 11 plus square root of 120. This 120 can be written as 4 into 5 into 6. Hence, this is equal to we can write 11 into square root of 11 plus square root of 4 into 5 into 6. This is equal to 11 into square root of 11 plus this can be written as square root of 4 into square root of 5 into square root of 6 which is equal to 11 into square root of 11 plus square root of 4 is 2 into root 5 
into root 6. Let us consider root 5 is A and root 6 is B. Then A plus B square is equal to A square plus B square plus 2 times A into B. Replacing A by root 5 and B by root 6. This can be written as root 5 plus root 6 square of this is equal to root 5 its square plus root 6 its square plus 2 times root 5 into root 6. Now here this square cancels with this square root. This square also cancels with this square root and this is equal to we can write 5 plus 6 plus 2 into square root of 5 into square root of 6 and which is equal to 5 plus 6 11 plus 2 root 5 into root 6 and which is this value means we can replace this value by square root of 5 plus square root of 6 its square. So, square root of 121 divided by 11 minus square root of 120, this can be written as 11 into square root of root 5 plus root 6 square. This square cancels with this square root. This is equal to 11 into square root of 5 plus square root of 6. Let us find square root of 6 and square root of 5 applying synthetic division method. A number whose square is very close to this number is 2 plus 2. 2 into 2. 4 subtract this 4 from 6 and 2 we have to put here 6 minus 4 2 and here 2 plus 2 4 now this 2 is less than this 4 so put decimal point here and then a pair of zeros after this 2 now divide this 20 by 4 that gives 5 but we have to put here 4 plus 4 this 4 we have to put here also 4 into 4 16 4 into 4 16 plus 1 17 subtract 176 from 200 this is equal to 24 again put a pair of zeros after this 24 4 plus 4 8 this 4 as it is if we divide this 24 by 4 it gives 6 but we want a number suppose this is 4 plus 4. This 4 also we have to put here. 4 into 4 16. 4 into 8 32 plus 1 33. 4 into 4 16 plus 3 19. Subtract 1936 from 2400 and this gives 464. Put again a pair of zeros after this 4. Taking addition of this 4 plus 4, 8. This 8 as it is 4. We have to put a number here which is suppose 9. Plus 9. 9 we have to put here also. 4889 into 9. This gives 44001. Subtract. Then 10 minus 1, 9. 10 minus 1, 9. 4 minus 1, 3. 6 minus 4, 2. 4 minus 4, 0. Again put a pair of zeros here. 9 plus 9, 18. 1 plus 8, 9, 8, 4. Once again we have to put a number here. Plus 4, 4 plus 4, 8, 8, 9, 4, 8. Multiply this number by 4 and put here. This 4 we have to put here also. 4, 4 is 16. 4, 8, 32 plus 1, 33. 
फोर नाइन जै थर्टी सिक्स प्लस थ्री नाइन फोर एट जै थर्टी टू प्लस थ्री थर्टी फाइव फोर फोर जै सिक्सटीन प्लस थ्री नाइनटीन सब टेक्ट एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू टेन माइनस सिक्स टेन माइनस फोर नाइनटीन माइनस टेन नाइन माइनस सिक्स एंड थर्टीन माइनस नाइन सो दिस इज स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ सिक्स सिमिलर टू दिस Applying same synthetic division method, we have to find out square root of five. Let us find a number whose square is very close to this five. So that number is two plus two, two plus two four, two into two four, and that number will be you have to put here also and subtract. So five minus four gives one. Now this one is less than four. Put decimal point here and put a pair of zeros after this one we have to find out a number like this 2 means 2 times 42 that will be less than 100 so plus 2 2 plus 2 4 and this 4 2 into 2 4 2 for just 8 so 100 minus 84 is 16 again put a pair of zeros After this six and four for the sixteen, so take a number less than four, that is three. Add three here. Three plus three six. Four and this four. Three into three nine. Three for the twelve. Three for the twelve plus one thirteen. And this three we have to put here as ten minus nine one. Ten minus Three seven six minus four two and one minus one zero. Again, put a pair of zeros after this one. If we divide twenty seven by four, that gives six. Take six here plus six. Addition of this four thousand four hundred seventy two. Multiply this quantity by six and put here six six ja thirty six 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 ja thirty six plus three thirty nine. Six four the twenty four plus three twenty seven. Six four the twenty four plus two twenty six. Subtract this number from this number that gives ten minus six four ten minus ten zero eleven minus eight three seven minus seven zero and two minus two zero. Okay. Now we have to put a pair of zeros after this four. So put here zero. And zero here, zero plus zero zero two seven four four zero 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 because thirty thousand four hundred is very less quantity as compared to forty four thousand seven hundred twenty. Okay, that's why subtracting we get here zero zero four zero three, and now we can put one more pair of zeros here, and then you can. Take any suitable value here. Before that, this zero we have to put here. Okay, so square root of five is approximately equal to two point two three six zero. Let us put the values of square root of five and square root of six here. So this is equal to eleven into square root of five is two point two three six zero plus square root of six is Two point four four nine four, and this is equal to eleven into. If we take addition of these two numbers, that is four point six eight five four. Eleven into four point six eight five four. This is equal to eleven into four forty four. Eleven into five fifty five plus four fifty nine. Eleven into eight eighty eight plus five ninety three. Eleven into six sixty six plus nine seventy five. Eleven into four forty four plus seven fifty one. Decimal point after four digit one two three four. So approximate value of this is equal to fifty one point five three nine four, which is obtained without using calculator. Hence we can say this is final answer. Thank you, thank you all, thank you for watching this video. Thanks a lot.